Hey, uh, how you doing everyone? Force Reader here, and welcome back to another episode of Oxen Free. But before we get back to this down here, I want to real quickly share with you guys a little clip I took from the recent eclipse, which is probably about a week ago, because that's how it was for when I recorded this video, or just whenever I decide to actually edit and upload this. Hopefully I won't take too long, but basically what I did was is I took an old welder's mask of mine and then draped my hoodie around it to kind of block out any of the light that could come in and kind of wash out the image for me. I also took out the clear lens that's in here. You can't tell because it's dark inside the helmet, but that's actually a clear glass lens, and I stole the lens out of these welding goggles to further increase uh, my protection from staring at the sun, and I did the same thing to my camera where I took a couple of um, sunglass lenses from a busted pair of sunglasses and taped those on the front just for some extra protection. And of course I wore some regular sunglasses while wearing it too. So you'll see that clip here. Oh shit, I did it. So zooming in did get it to focus. Unfortunately, it's too late for the, I guess the zenith, but it is kind of cool that I got this much. Yeah, and, and it was okay. It was really cool. Um, unfortunately, the clouds have rolled in right when the eclipse was at its maximum potential. I guess you could say, you know, when it had perfectly blocked out the sun in my area. So that was sad. Actually, that kind of sucked. I really wanted to see that. But, you know, partial eclipse on video. Not that bad. Kind of cool. So anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get to the game. Put this stuff away. Well, when you look at that, it didn't collapse. That's one good thing that happened tonight. Don't fret so much. Don't worry too You're much. with Alex right now, all right? Queen of the... Um... I'm not helping you. You can say that again. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. First you blame me for everything, then you say I'm not even helping. <laughs> you used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the island, I mean... I mean, that's what Ren made it sound yeah. like. Yeah. With my brother. With Michael? Yeah? Like, with your mom and dad, or...? Sometimes mom and dad, but... Mostly just him and me. Oh, that's cool. Like he's... like he'd be babysitting you and he'd bring you out here? That's nice of him. He could've just stayed home, you know? It wasn't like that. We were, like, best friends. It's not like he was being forced to do it. He wanted to do it. We liked hanging out together. Oh, I mean, I didn't mean... Yeah, yeah, of course. But here's the tent. I gotta at some point apologize and try to make Jonas not feel, Some people camp you know, here, but so it's weird. I, I don't know why they just leave their tent. Looks kind of dumpy. Like, I don't know, like it's been abandoned. Yeah, I can see this place being cool like in the summer or even in the spring. You got the park, you got the main street shops. Yeah, it's pretty nice. It can mm -hmm. be pretty nice I, I, when the, say so. the conditions are right, you know? All right, let's go ahead and move on. I, I can't remember. I think this is where things start getting kind of trippy. We yeah, used to come yeah here there's the trippy. Kid, right? To the island. I mean, I mean, that's what Ren made it sound like. Uh, do you ever get deja vu? I feel like, like, didn't we just walk through here? Huh. That's funny, I, I don't think we have. I only mention it because my family trips were awful. My mom would always insist on going to Missouri every single year. Ugh. I mean, it was all we could afford, but still. That's a long... <laughs> Why was it so bad? There just was nothing to do. And my parents wanted to give me a good time, and they couldn't, and I could tell. I don't know. I look back on it now, and those dumb trips are kind of like, they're just containers for, I don't know, the memories that I have with her. Nowadays, I think, 
what stuff happens matters more than where stuff happens. But I don't know. I changed my mind a lot on that. Yeah, I think I agree. It's just a theory, anyway. <laughs> it, it, it's interesting, uh, the things that they say in this game. It, it, it does a good job of making you think. It really does. Wait, wasn't this... <sighs> we passed this a minute ago, right? And it wasn't burning? I, um, honestly don't remember. Yeah, Jonas, you never, you never remember this stuff. And, yeah, I can't go look at the tent again. Just go ahead and try to get out of here. Oh, you used oh. to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the islands. I actually kind of I mean, enjoy when it does that. I mean, that's that. what Ren made it sound like. We have definitely been here before. This is weird. What's weird? Because I don't remember any of this. Jonas, we've already done this. We keep walking past these same trees and the same spot, and you keep asking the same crap over and over. Um, okay. I mean, it if you say so, aggressive. but like, I don't even know what you're saying. What are you saying? <sighs> Are we lost? Or is keep it... repeating this one moment for some <sighs> reason. God, can't things stay normal for like two friggin' seconds? Well, it's nope. more than a little troubling that I can't tell besides a uh, headache I've only just noticed, but okay, let's deal with this now, sure. Jonas, I'm not trying to freak you out, man, but you know, stuff's getting weird. Kick the this ball. This is, uh, new. Ah, oh, it's... it's kind of weird. I had the exact same kind when I was a kid. Yeah, why Kick would a toy ball. company make two, right? Oh, love the jokes. <laughs> Keep it up. See what happens. Take that, ball. Um... <laughs> what? So, it's just... I'm taking a picture of the ball moving, not your kicking, just so you know. Yay, more of this. Well, now. Uh, okay, I'd, I'd like to know where this is going. Uh, okay, I'd, I'd like to know where this is going. Maybe don't antagonize whoever. Uh, alright, let's not, um, make it weird now, radio people. Can I kick it again? Yay! I think they have a sense of humor. That's not very nice. I, I, I don't know. I, I kind of like it. It's pretty funny to me, at least. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Forgot about that. <sighs> my doctor's not going to be happy with my blood pressure this year. Yeah, mine neither. Ready to continue? Oh, he just faces away. And one more time for luck. Jonas! Jonas, where... Where are you? Yeah, the world kind of normalized a little bit. At least that's good. I love the, the longer I take to actually play this game, the less and less I remember, which just makes it you know, a little bit more fun. And it all comes flooding back to me. It's kind of a neat feeling. I bet that's kind of... How am I... Is this an optical illusion or something? That's kind of like how what Alex is going through with the time loops and stuff. Tell uh, Michael to break Yay. up with Clarissa. It's for the best. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Wait, wait, we've Thank you, done me this for the before. Advice. Okay, uh, there's got to be a way out, or... <sighs> it's alright, we must have just missed, um, something. Yeah, there's always something. Are you... can you kind of remember more now? It's starting to stick. Yeah, I mean, it's still sort of foggy, but whatever, I'll deal with it. Huh, this is... It's just like the armoire in the cave. Super duper old, but in like, new condition. Oh, I didn't mean to... You know, I didn't realize I felt like a 
pressure in my head until right now. Maybe doing that fixed the loop. But whatever you did helped some- Yeah, but making it sound right did what? I... I don't know, but it's like my allergies cleared up or something. Let's just keep going and get Ren. I definitely feel like I'm picking different stuff now. And not on purpose either. It's, uh, unless there was an update and they changed some of the dialogue, uh, this definitely feels different from the last time I played this. Of course, this part still is the same, me running around. So... ghosts, huh? <sighs> ghosts. Yeah. What do you think they want? The, um, the ghosts. Do they have to want anything? Just most of the time, don't they like... I mean, isn't that why they're trapped here or whatever? Because they didn't do something they needed to in life or... I don't think our previous knowledge of movies and comic books applies here, really. But fine. I just hope they want to like, play soccer every once in a while, and that's it. Yeah, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Machine gun fire. Oh, hey. I think I found the right tune. Yay. I was in love. Danger. One. Yesterday, the remains of four bodies were discovered in two cars submerged west of Cape Mears. How the cars got in the water, no one... That is weird. I don't... Was it about dead bodies? I don't remember. That, that's it's really odd. And again, was there anything cool up here? Or is this something for later? I think it's something for later. Jeez, I keep going for the anomalies. But I know I should wait till later, because if I'm gonna go around exploring the whole island, you know, I kinda wanna go ahead and get everything in one big go. Still cool though. Mm, I can't resist. I cannot resist. Uh-oh, hey, here we go. Dog Niner. Bay Chimo. Thresher. Peterhoff. Arizona. What? Say that again? Dog Niner. D9. Bay Chimo. Thresher. Peterhoff. Arizona. BTPA. Okay. I remember this. The two Jacks carved their... Uh, Jack Mitchell and Jack Ladd, they used to hang out together all the time. And they carved their names into this bench on a school trip once. You don't care, do you? No, please, keep going. Thanks, okay. I will. On another school trip, they... Stop. I <laughs> uh. uh, love the Panzer S game. I really, really, really do. Okay? Don't come anywhere near me. No, no. Just don't. Okay, just calm down. This night has turned banana bread really fast. And I'm seeing things and forgetting things. And I bumped into you once already. And it was horrible. We haven't. It, this is the first time we've seen you since the beach. Be that as it may, I've seen an Alex. So just look. You're not going to talk about my grandfather. You're just going to stand there politely. And tell me if you've seen Clarissa. Because I've been looking. We're here because we think Ren is somewhere in the woods. Have you seen him? No, not Ren. Yeah, I don't want to bring okay, up the whole Clarissa life. out of the Listen, no, window no. thing. You should come with us. That way we're not all, you know, separated. 
I'm not going anywhere with you. All right, okay, hey, I get it, I do. Wow. I'm jumpy right now too, but... Just let her go, Jonas, she's a space monkey right wait, now. Wait, wait, just... Nona, can you do me a favor? Can you just... Can you go to the comm tower and wait for us? We got the lights on there, and... It seems pretty safe. Yeah, that's actually... That's a good idea. Go to the comm tower and just sit tight till we get back. And the comm tower is... where? It's the cloud buster at the edge of town. Can't miss it. All right, bye. That girl's a peach. Yeah, I don't know how well she would have responded to me saying that Clarissa jumped out of a window and then vanished. Because that is some spooky, spooky, spooky stuff. Like, extra screwball. Ball. <laughs> Hey, just for me, why'd you let me flip the switch back at the bridge? To be honest, I expected you to just pull ahead and do it yourself. But you didn't. Because you wanted to, that's why. Pretty simple, really. All right. Okay, that must be the way station. And actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Like, nobody's going anywhere. Doesn't the whole thing just... Um, this was a... A mining island before the war. And the land, you know, as you can tell, it wasn't really conducive to ah, most different ways of transport, so they dug into the hills and laid down tracks and carted the coal by freight to the, um, the pier for the boats. Can I ask you something? Wow. She knows a lot about this island. <laughs> yeah, of course. You think I'm kind of a slacker idiot, right? Like, I wouldn't find any of this stuff interesting? Jonas, I think you're smart. Come on, what are you talking about? Hmm, I don't know. I just sometimes get these, like, whiffs of... I don't know. I can't think of the word don't, for it. Don't worry about it. Maybe it's stress? Like, from what's going on? Right now? You think I don't know stress? I know stress. <laughs> okay. It's like... It's like, I don't know. Nah, it'll come to me. Getting a little worried there, buddy? Wait, can I access it from this side or do I have to go the other way? Oh, I can access it this way. Cool. Oh, 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 no, don't do that. Guys, Jesus, it took you forever to get here. What happened? I've been scared out of my mind. Hearing things, seeing things. We went to Milner first. Clarissa was having a slow motion conniption and I don't know, it just seemed more pressing. Oh my God, Clarissa can handle herself. I'm the one that needed a babysitter until I was 14. Do you have like any I, idea I what's going that. on? Okay, that must be the way station and Actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Ugh, Jonas, we're repeating the same stuff again. We are? Ugh, it's kind of weird that you can tell when it's happening and I can't, right? I mean, it's not like... I mean, I'm glad someone can tell, but... I'm more worried about the actual, like, whole time falling apart thing than whether or not you noticed it, Jonas. Yeah, no, that's, um, still on my mind. Trust me. There's your boy. Okay, well, let's see what... Yep. Yeah. Uh-oh. Hey, Ren! We made it, finally. Um, Ren? Ren! Is he in shock or something? He looks weird. Yeah, I don't know. What's he doing? Is he, like... Sleepwalking? I don't know how he like fell asleep yeah, during that's all this. A lot worse. But I've seen sleepwalking. Okay, Michael 
sleepwalked, and the worst he'd do is take his pillow into the hallway. This is like something else. Ren? Are you in there? Come on, pal, the neighbors are here and they want to borrow some sugar. This isn't a guy on drugs. Not that I want to, like, alarm you. Yeah, I don't want to say the word possession here, but... But... what? He's possessed. But he's possessed. It's possession. He's... yeah, he's clearly possessed. Well, you know, let's not jump to conclusions here, but maybe it's not that. Yeah. Well, I guess if I do this, it will fix the time loop thing, but... I think I remember something else goes down here, too. Wait, no, not that. I don't know if you remember, but the last time we got stuck, we used one of these things to get out of it, so I'm not just messing around right now. Yeah, I remember, I remember. Kind of. And presto, that's one. I feel like I remember there being like three of these last time. I only see two. And he's gone. Hey, where'd Ren go? He was standing no time right for that. there. Ren! Are you I'll still here? Oh. Broken phone, that's never fun. Oh. Um. Crap. I remember this. I don't. Now. Maybe we shouldn't, um, go near him. Ren, can you. Can you hear me? I mean, I know they say don't move somebody with a spine injury, but it's like, we gotta do something, right? Yeah, um, any thoughts on what we could do? If I did have any thoughts on what would solve this, wouldn't that be a little weird? Yeah. Yeah, and you can't walk up to him. I guess I have to do the radio thing. Is this... Is that a wait, wait. Thing, but... Helping him, hopefully. I don't know. Wrong way, real. Wait, there, there. Yay. Jesus, Ren, are, are you? I'll go. Talk through child. Oh, and Jonas vanished. Uh oh. Feels stretched. Better. No. Jonas, where did you? We are abounding. That one. one. Silly. But do not. Our dolls would never plot. Can we, uh, help you, or...? Leave. Possible. Uh, maybe? But I, I don't really... Grounded. Bye. Adler. So, uh, Margaret. Pretty. Little. Poppy. Peggy Adler. That old woman? What does she have to do with anything? Old woman was... Young once we were young once sit still bear fruit tag <laughs> ah! Holy mother of God you guys God Ren You're alive I am I am why was that a question at first? Why? Why is this... why? Actually, thanks for coming, by the way. Sure. Why is this happening? I mean, I've been here. I visited this place like 15 times. And before now, the worst thing that ever happened was like, a kid would lose his shorts to the undertow. Um, we kinda did something weird. What, what do you mean? Did you... did you curse the island? Did Ren, you... we were trapped in the cave We and... were all in the cave. The exit had completely, like, disappeared. Disappeared? 
We tried to tune in this thing with the radio, and it opened something, and now there's like a poltergeist running around. Yeesh. If we don't have our skin tomorrow, I'm blaming you. Guys, anyone? Is this thing working? If no, anyone can well, hear no. this, out there, in a whatever, I, I'm at the con tower on Edwards Island. Hey, she listened to us. Great. So, if anyone can... What is this? I, I'm trying to communicate with the... Does she know how to even work that stuff? Doesn't sound like it. Ugh. Can't, like, anyone work a two-way radio? Didn't everyone have that, like, one trucker uncle who let them work the CB a few times for fun? Guess not. I think that was our cue then. It's kind of a shortcut back to the communication tower if we go through this fence. Shouldn't take that long. I'm glad you can make sense of this place's geography, because I'm still struggling. It, it, it's actually okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Enough of that. Wait, are the the triangle things, when they get like this, is this like when they stop working or something else? Uh, I don't think I took whatever class would have taught me that. Was this what you called us on? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then it just kind of exploded. Ooh. Wish she'd chat with me a little. What was the, uh... Shit, what was the map? Oh, there's the map. Mm... Oh, 102.3. That was the... One for the station. Lease it to several mining companies throughout the early 1900s. This relay station served as the center of a makeshift railroad that carted coal to northern and southern piers. When Edwards died, the government saw a hole in national security at the outset of World War II and decided to take control of the island once again, founding Fort Milner in 1941. This island has had many owners. Portuguese explorers, Spanish settlers, but few stayed long, preferring the ranch work offered by the mainland. After 1890, the island was gifted to Colonel Caleb Edwards for his part in the American Indian Wars, and he would lease it to several mining companies throughout the early 1900s. Okay, well that's interesting. I don't remember the game giving me any real options to explain to Ren what was going on, so that's kind of neat. I really, really don't remember, or if it was an addition, or or whatever. I, I don't know. Oh, man! You know what just jumped into my head just completely randomly? That show in the, uh, it was a horse ranch? Or a horse farm, but... But that makes it sound like they have a little cabbage patch field of horses. Wait, there was a... there was a show... at a horse ranch? A year ago, out in Salem? We took over a stable and our band played and you... you ditched that test again, right? To... to bring us a new amp? Because during the sound check, we blew... What about tonight made this pop into your head? Is it... is it just because we're, like, outside? I don't know. But I can't believe you didn't tell Jonas this story yet. She had already blown off this, like, super important for school placement aptitude test once and... Why'd you do that? Um, I think she was... Michael had just died, like, a month or two before, and I... I don't know, I just wasn't in the quizzing mood. But you know, it's... whatever, that's... that's not part of the story. Anyways, she was gonna retake it, and on the day of, I had to emergency call her way out in the... just picture, like, Little House on the Prairie. I don't know what that is. It's a... really? You don't know what Little House on the Prairie is? Wait, you blew off an important test to get him an amp? Really? That was a thing you did? Yeah, I mean... He needed his amp. And it was just a stupid test, so who cares? And the funny part is, I'd taken that same test after dosing a bunch of cough medicine, and I still aced it, so she would have blown it out of the water. And even knowing that, she still came out to help me. That's awesome, right? Well, you failed to tell me that part. Maybe that's why this is a more meaningful memory to me than you. Yeah, I mean, even if you think the test was stupid, I don't know. Can't help but feel that you maybe should have probably still done it. 
Really? Even if at the time she didn't care? How come? Hmm. Why do you think so? Listen, it's just... Like, if I was good at what you guys are good at, which is being smart, I wouldn't waste one of my few remaining test days on a show in a barn. No offense. Hey, none taken. Words to live by. Don't squander your potential on music manure. Well, sorry. I dragged you out there and made you pet a horse and drink moonshine. Oh, well, now that I know that moonshine was involved... I don't remember that being a part of anything either. And you guys are slow. Whoa, I didn't... I didn't do that. Okay, that was un unexpected. I, I did not open that up. That was weird. Mayday! May oh, crap. Uh. This isn't... This is just coming out of speakers in the roof thing, isn't it? <laughs> She's adorable, isn't she? Ugh. My god, is this what I sound like? She's trying. How can anyone see how she's stand to listen to me all day? And, uh, so give my lungs a breather. My stupid chest's on fire for some reason. Smoke will do that. Yes, it will. Definitely gonna be leaving you two behind. Oh, hey guys. I see you down there. Oh. And without Clarissa. Actually, I'm gonna stop talking since obviously isn't working. So just come on up and you can help or something. God, this stupid thing. She doesn't sound good, right? She sounds a little off. I don't know her well enough. She's just tired, Ren. We're all tired. I mean, hell, I would have been tired by now if all we'd been doing was drinking and laying on the beach. Yeah, I guess. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just about to start doing its thing. Wait, second brownie? Run, please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mmm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. If you're down... Uh, fine. If that's what it takes to get you through the night, then okay. Great. I don't need it. I just needed it now. Oh, God. That was, that was such a dumb, dumb thing to do. So stupid. Just, wait, are, where are they at? How long are they going to take to follow me? Oh, okay, there they are. I can't see how anyone would ever think something like that would have been a good idea to go ahead and... Well, anything that would mess with you, you know, impair your judgment in a situation like this. This thing doesn't work. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like... I don't know. What won't work? The, uh, radio? It, like, works, but... Uh, uh sorry, I was, like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been... been... ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. The blackouts, the hallucinations, it's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah, and it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh! Oh, I got it. This is great. This is perfect. I know exactly what to do. Do you? Yeah, totally. It's Maggie Adler. Maggie Adler? Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. Oh, boy. Thank God for that memory. Yeah, finally something positive jarred loose through all the hysteria. My sister, Allie, worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a Burnout. Okay, so I like Well, to... and I'm not saying it's the best plan, but what other plan is there really, Jonas? Oh, I don't know. Fix the radio, find Clarissa, set fire to the mug shop. And these are just off the top of my head. Yeah, I'm still worried about Clarissa. 
But we can't fix the radio. We don't know how. I'm not saying literally do that. I'm just... There's other things we can do. <laughs> but there isn't. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want oh. us to trust you when things are really bad? You had Alex bring the radio. You brought us here. Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, no. we all grew no. up with each other. Alex knows- Okay, Ren, just take a step back, all right? Jonas isn't a weirdo. He's a, he's a good guy. What? Your good guy is like deploying a missile barrage of insanity on me right now. I know you said Ren is like harmless or whatever, but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is my best friend. Yeah, and she could hardly must- Okay, you're arguing 15 things at once now. Do the plan, trust Jonas, leave Ren, like pick a target, or better yet, just don't. Yeah. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there what is, is a that? boat That's at Maggie cool. Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't yeah, be. Yeah, it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever. I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my... Like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You, uh... Just shut up! Both of you! Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night... Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of... Keeping in mind who's taller, who do you want coming with you? Nona? Wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean... I guess... Why this are you isn't, making me shack up with this guy? It's my friggin' plan. We've been together the why? <laughs> this is why. Easiest question I've been asked all night. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is it's fine. This will be a good... If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But no, nobody's happy with this. I think Nona's uh, happy about it. Hey, Nona's happy. You're happy, right? Um, sure. <laughs> Okay, yay. Go back into town, get the keys, go to Adler's. Sounds like a plan. Just remember which one's the map key. There we go. Let's go talk to uh, Ren first. No hard feelings, right? Good luck with the thing, Alex. Pick the wrong one. I still need you, Jonas, okay? So keep your knee pads on, mentally speaking. I'll see you when you get back, Alex. Hmm. I wonder if I could try that again. We're still friends, Ren. If Missy's sixth grade birthday party couldn't split us up, this certainly won't. Good luck with the thing, Alex. Okay. Oh, I can't look at the stuff in here earlier. I noticed that while they were all fighting, I was able to look at the radio and the phone and all that. I still need you, Jonas, okay? So keep your knee pads on, mentally speaking. I'll see you when you get back, Alex. Man, they are pissed. Oh well, Nona time! Let's go, Nona! Totally gonna bring up Ren. How he likes you, and all that other stuff. See how that works out. Let's go! You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, it's it's nothing to be sorry about. 
I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you'd remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But suspensions are like paid vacation, you can just do your work over. So... It's like, what's the point? Wait, if you don't really go to, like, class, what are you doing instead all day? Jenny, the TA, she lets me practice ballet in her studio. So that... Ooh. Really? Oh, That's cool. and don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. I think Clarissa's out of town, so it shouldn't be a problem. Well, happy early birthday! In my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. You gotta get in the mind state. Thanks. I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. That's not true. I was thinking about, uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa and... Well, I was thinking about my last birthday when, you know, actually, if I get the chance, sorry, I should tell her what's never up. mind. This has nothing to do with anything. I'm just in a fog right now. Sorry. No, come on. I want to hear this. It was last year, your birthday. Go. Jess, this was when Nicole was in her car accident, and so of course we cancel and go visit her, and I'm not going to pout about that. It's common oh. decency. It's fine. But afterwards, after this totally emotionally draining night, Clarissa still came over and surprised me with this huge cake. And we stayed up and watched all my favorite movies, and she didn't have to do that. That's sweet, actually. Anyways, my birthday's in three days, and I just hope she's okay. That's all. We'll find her, Nona. We're not leaving without her. Ugh, yeah, I know. Anomaly time. I'm surprised it doesn't give you an option to kind of like blow the lid on the whole Clarissa jumping out of the window thing. Oh, music. Uh, there we go. The island is famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. The forceful removal of an ignorant people to make space for destined holders is a time-honored tradition in our still young country. And you will be a part of that heritage, Alex. Do not resist. It will be oh. over soon. Oh, that, that's... That, that... Super ominous. Super ominous. Screw this. Run. Let's just... Let's just get out of here. Oh, hey, a bunker. Molded with layers of poured concrete and packed earth. The lead blast door will only unlock through use of the call and response system, a setup devised by Lieutenant Commander Matthew Feinberg to prevent tampering. If the Catbird Station, a small watch point in Edwards Forest, radios in a decoded attack, the shelter door will automatically open, triggering an alarm and compulsory evacuation. This early version of what would today be considered a blast and fallout shelter was commissioned and built in 1946. The above-ground hub leads to a bunker 60 feet beneath the Earth's surface, molded with layers of poured concrete and packed earth. The lead blast door will alarm. only unlock through use of the... Yeah, th there's no alarm. Uh, uh, come on. I think I'm going the right way anyway. Uh, maybe not. Or maybe yes. Any scripted talk here? Guess not. Oh wait, have I done this yet? I don't know. One oh two point three. This data command annex, as it had been dubbed, was used during the base's early years as the communication nerve center for outside military installations. It was also the primary office of Marianne Bozek, a civilian who developed communications protection through the invention of the famed wall system. A type of radio frequency identification, wall, standing for wave-assisted lock, 
assigned each person who was stationed at Fort Milner a call sign through which they could use their portable two-wave radios to unlock prescribed doors and gates. Though the mechanics are considered outmoded today, the island still uses this security method to That's honor cool. its rich history. So, it's the Parks and Facilities Building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah, we're... we're close. That was a short conversation. But there'd be, you know, more to it than that. But okay. Ah! Uh, uh, come on. There we go. Clarissa! What are you... How did she get up there? What are you doing? She's alive. You, you're alive. Man, I've never been so happy to see you in my life. Clarissa! What? Alex! Christ, what's wrong with her? Clarissa, can you... All kinds of stuff. Can you hear me? Alex, do you know what's happening? Is she... Is she gonna be okay? Clarissa, wake up. Fight them off. Take control of yourself. Um, hang in there, baby. Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something? Please, just try anything. Like, uh... Clarissa! This happened to Jonas, too. It's... it's... Uh, I don't know. It's like when they want to talk or something. Oh, God. Clarissa, can you... On the beach and... Can you hear me? Alex, come on, just please try and get her down. Elise, please, somehow. Oh, I'll do something. Carissa, can you come down? Ugh, she just looks awful. You think you can control me? Clarissa, are you... Are you not... Possessed right now? Possessed. I am possessed. I am consumed with an unending fury. She was wonderful with her hands. Yet, I keep hurting, and I really don't want to. Consumed with... What are you mad at? We're... We've all been... I'm not mad, dear. I'm tired. When you're off, the little machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart. Oh! Is she okay, or she's... I think so. Oh, Clarissa, are you okay? <sighs> you scared the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. Okay. Are you sure? Because that didn't look great. <sighs> Do you remember anything that happened? <sighs> I remember waiting in Fort Milner and seeing you. That was a while ago. How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? There's been, like, time disturbances or something, and I think that's what's been teleporting people around, so... And we just had one. Time disturbances? So you're just blank? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Oh, that's not fair. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Oh, guys, okay, I know you think we're still playing truth or slap or whatever, but this isn't real, so... Well, wait. Clarissa hasn't gotten a chance to ask something yet, so... Yeah, and you, of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend, and your new step- Clarissa, please don't draw a chalk line here. Don't make factions, just... We have to stick together if we're gonna make it through this. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way this story goes. She- Why? Why does it have to be my fault? Why does it have to be your fault? Are you kidding no, me? No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right You're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God. The town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking forehead. And the giant, lit up, Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. Because of her. 
Like, do you It would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free, he was out of here, until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her arms. Clarissa. Ugh. It doesn't make it my fault. Anyone could have been there, anyone, and then they would have had to watch him die, you unbelievable prick. Anyone wouldn't have watched him die, Alex. Anyone else would have done something. Okay, I'm sorry, but enough, Clarissa. That's enough. It's too much right now. I can't, I can't believe. Ugh. She's Seriously, enough. Nona, it was awful, all right? It, it's still awful, and, and I... I don't, just, Alex, this is none of my business, okay? None. But we came here to do a thing, and that thing is going to get us home. So let's get home. No. Uh, Clarissa, what are you... All the outs in free. Hey. Yeah, whoa. major screwball. Man, do you ever, do you ever get deja vu? Jeez, I just got a serious thing of goosebumps from one. Boy. Uh, I guess you don't remember, like, anything that just happened, right? Um, to what... Anything are you referring, exactly? Uh, Clarissa being possessed and shrieking at me would probably be the big kahuna here. I, huh, I sort of can picture Clarissa being like weird or something, but I don't know, it's kind of a blur to be honest. Okay, well, the office that we gotta try to get into is like right there, so yeah. let's try yeah, no, no. whatever our way in. Yep, this isn't budging. Um, I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. I don't get enough breaking down doors in my life, really, so I'm not going to complain. <sighs> that was easy. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. Ooh. Hey, know Zero. what kind of jet that is? Nope. Cool. Carry on. To sign up for the aquatics program, please register at the front desk. Uh, okay. Has that happened before? Yeah, but you'll get used to it. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, I think, but it's like there's way more stations on the dial. Ooh, neato. Here's another one. It says, they're wall radios, oh, wave oh. assisted lock, whatever that means. Oh, duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. So they're like ID tags or something. It must work for the game. Uh, okay, cool. Great. Ooh, wait. Wait, here's like a... Wait, what is this? Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family, or like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? No, we can start back. I just wanna... Okay, here. To who... Oh, okay, still about leave. Yeah, gotcha. Whom is your concern? This. this island and its history is a lie. Jeez, she didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? What? What could that mean? I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Many truths? Shh. Inside you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons and the notes within, and discover the true chronicle of the island. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt! Scavenger hunt! <laughs> wait, wait. To whosoever finds the material, know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I helped preserve. But also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly, for the interest of time itself, Margaret Adler. Oh, Christ. This is... This is, like, literally a treasure map. Well, kinda. It's neat, but I don't know. We should probably just get home before we, like, die. Yeah, no, I get that. Um, but first... 
What does it say? One oh. Does it list it on here? Did she say one oh four point one. I don't remember. Ah. Oh my God! The the Canaloa was destroyed by friendly fire. We we've been lied to all this time. There we go. Let's see here, the USS Walter Roy, a destroyer escort, sunk the USS Canaloa with friendly fire on October 25th, 1943. Had had held a developmental nuclear reactor in its belly and had been sent out weeks earlier as a test of its capabilities. Relatively few even knew of its existence, which tripled the basis, the basis confusion when the submarine's communications had been cut. No one outside of a handful of us would ever know the truth. I would discover later that a weapons technician of the Walter Roy had been at Francis Salter's wedding. Salter was an engineer on the Canaloa. I don't know why, but it's strange to me. That is a little extra weird. And with that, I think I have been recording long enough um we i'd say we we got a good bit of progress and now we've got the wall radio so we can open up all kinds of doors and now we can actually look for the adler notes uh, i think i'm gonna try to look for more of those along with uh finding all of the anomalies and hey let me know if you prefer this camera angle or if you like the way that the mic's going right now i kind of forgot to plug my camera in so it's actually about to die but anyway thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it or if you just have an appeared voice why don't you go ahead and leave your comments down below and uh i'll get back to making more awesome videos for you guys later